I am one with my glorious I am presence. And to my I am presence, I align all the parts of my being, my Christ self, my personalities, my body elemental, and new spirit, so that all parts of my being are in balance, harmony, and alignment. And my aura is fully contained within my heart diamond and Metatron's cosmic egg. I am now ready for today's message. Greetings, beloveds. What joy it is for us in the ascended realms to perceive the magnificent light that you are accepting into your beings daily. We see you as a light bulb that is gradually becoming lighter and lighter with each passing day. We have long awaited this time on your planet, beloveds. Although, as I have told you many times, from our perspective, in timeless awareness, the ascension of the entire planet has already occurred. That does not prevent us from being aware in your now moment and watching this enlightenment, this unfoldment take place within each and every one of you our most beloved children. So take a few minutes to be with me now in this state of joy at the enlightenment or the ascension or whatever you want to call it is taking place. And with each passing day you are becoming more joyful, more serene, more loving, and more forgiving, less judgmental, less fearful, less angry. When you are with yourself all the time, it is sometimes hard for you to judge the progress that you have made because it happens in such small increments that it is barely noticeable. But I would like you to take a look back for just a moment to where you were and who you were just a year ago or before you started watching these videos or before you woke up to the reality of spiritual and eternal life and then see how you are now it's quite different isn't it I want you to celebrate this now moment as you perceive your attainment, your progress, which can be best measured by the love and the joy and the peace in your being. And then as you listen to the rest of this video, I would like you to be focused as much as you can on your inner being, on that part of you that is love, joy, and peace at all times. 
even when you forget. That part of you is very much alive. It is very conscious of you. Even when you drop into unconsciousness about it, Before you began walking the path of spirituality, your I am presence tended to ignore you as you were ignoring it. But once you begin earnestly on the path, that all changes. Your I am presence, your divine self, takes a great interest in you and will continue to be conscious of you even when you are not conscious of it. This is part of the grace, of the blessings, of giving your life to God, of asking for guidance and assistance along the path. of following your religion, whatever it might happen to be. When you truly desire to know God, to know your own true self, then the entire universe will come to your assistance. And first and foremost, your very own divine self. It will be constantly attempting to communicate with you, to advise you, to guide you. It may come in many different forms, beloveds. And I ask you to be attentive to these. It can come through a book, a television show, a conversation with a person that you have just met in the store. Your I Am Presence will use any situation where it feels you are open to hearing it. You do not need to be a conscious channel in order to start receiving messages from your own divine self. You just need to be attentive and alert. And when something is suggested to you, take it into your heart and see how it feels. Does it feel right? Does it feel like something you want to invest your time and energy in? If it does, then go with it, beloveds, regardless of what your mind thinks about it. For your mind can only make decisions based on your past. And it is a new day, beloveds, for all of you. It is a time of new opportunities, of new thoughts and feelings. And so if you try to make your decisions based on the past, you are likely to encounter resistance and confusion. So take these new decisions into your heart for your heart is also new. It is changing every day as you become more loving, forgiving, and peaceful. And so with each day, there is greater clarity within you and a greater ability to hear the messages from your heart. This is what I wish for you, beloveds. 
I cannot force this upon you. For you are growing in your mastery. And you must make every decision on your own. You must learn to distinguish between the voice of the past and the voice of the now. With practice, you will get better at this. And then you will have more peace, more love, and more joy in your life. Your entire life will be transformed, beloveds. And so will those of your loved ones. Because as you change, everything around you changes. Your relationships, your interactions with objects, and everything that surrounds you. The weather, your government, everything will change as you change. So do not hesitate to give as much energy and attention as you can to your spiritual path. It will make everything in your life better. And you will be assisting in making life better for everyone, everywhere. I send you infinite amounts of love and of joy. Breathe them into your being. Allow yourself to overflow with this divine joy, for it is truly who you are, always have been, and always will be. I love and bless you. I am Metatron.